all of us have to take care of the land because my belief is that it, we need to be custodians of it, I guess, for the next generation. We wanted to put another generation of dairy farms on this farm because we've seen too many of them disappear over the years. Dean Marshick and his wife, Claire Palmquist, are true partners in life, in love, and most definitely in dairy farming. Claire was originally a city girl. City girl, but a country girl at heart. Uh, she came to the farm and just jumped right in, and, and uh, we work well as a team. Dean, on the other hand, is a fifth generation dairy farmer. His great grandfather built the house they live in today. So dairy farming is in Dean's blood, and Claire has come to love and respect the heritage of Marshak Dairy. In order to honor the past and guarantee the dairy sustainability, they look to the future. I think what our concern more was that we were seeing, especially in this area, a decline in the dairy farms. Sustainability for us is more making sure that this goes into the future as a dairy farm. I think sustainability is moving the farm on to the next generation. Um, treating the environment right, treating the animals right, treating your local community right, I think is as long as we are all here working together, I think that's what sustainability is. Dean and Claire went to work, investing in a bold set of moves designed to ensure the dairy remains sustainable, energy efficient, and profitable for generations to come. First, they put up a 20 kilowatt wind turbine, which offset the farm's electrical costs by about 12%. They also added solar panels and reduced energy use by another 8%. One thing that we kept coming back to in a lot of regards is we don't see power as becoming less expensive over time. Wind and solar are just one more crop that we harvest. We just don't have to till the field to get it. The Marshicks also designed and built a new state-of-the-art freestall barn equipped with energy-efficient fluorescent lighting and thermostatically controlled fans and misters. They also installed temperature-controlled inflatable curtains to capture the warmth generated by the cows to heat the barn in the winter and on cool mornings. The curtains go down for ventilation on hot days. But by far the most innovative move was to install a robotic milking system to handle the farm's 155 cows. The milkers are a technological and engineering marvel. The cows are herded into and out of the milking area through a series of gates, but only when the computer determines that it's the proper time for each cow to be milked. Once the cow enters the milking station, a robot arm takes over. It washes and disinfects the cow's teats. Then, using an infrared beam, locates and attaches a milking suction unit and waits patiently while the cow is milked. The cows have benefited from the use of robotics. If, if you look behind me, you can see those cows are casual, they're relaxed, they're curious, they're not upset. Because they're going to the robot and being milked on a regular basis, it makes for a healthier cow. And happier, healthier cows produce more milk. Because of the renewable energy and automation improvements, the dairy is now milking 60% more cows and has increased milk production by 48%. We chose to take the risk to invest in building a new facility and, and make it attractive to the next generation. And one of the ways that we could do that is by incorporating a technology that they use every day, which is computers and robotics. I can still sit there and watch them, and I'm amazed at it, you know, that it actually works. In fact, it works so well that Marshak Dairy was recently recognized with a U.S. Dairy Sustainability Award for energy efficiency. It's an incredible honor. I, I still don't think we do anything different than, than most dairy farmers. We're just working every day trying to get better and you know trying to support you know the dairy industry and the local economy and our family and, and our cows and the environment. You just do the best you can every day. So I don't know that I want to say we were trendsetters because a lot of other people had done it before we had done it. But I think we found it attractive, and we, if we found it attractive, we figured the younger generation would find it even more attractive. It's just about keeping the farm alive and moving forward. I mean, if you're not moving forward, you're probably not going to be around a whole lot longer. 
I guess we're, we're kind of lucky in a way because we actually make a better team together than we do apart. A formidable team working hard to ensure the sustainability of Marshik Dairy.